In this Blender tutorial I will show you how to create a slow motion video clip. I've assumed you have a basic understanding of editing in Blender. I've left a link to a couple of my beginners tutorial in the description below this video. One for version 2.8 which is the version I should be using in this tutorial and another for older versions of Blender. Other tutorials can be found in my playlists. OK well I've brought this video clip into um, Blender and I haven't changed any of the settings so we still got the standard 250 frames here. Um, doing a slow motion video clip in Blender is just just a slightly bit more involved than doing a um, fast forward or a speeding up a video clip. So the first thing you need to look at is in this box here the length of your clip so this is telling me my clip is 204 frames long so if I wanted to slow this down by half what I need to do is double the length of frames now if you go into the output box sort of top uh, right here and in the box it says um, N250 what I'm going to do is I'm going to left click and type in 40 Eight, and hit return. So effectively I've doubled the number of frames or I would have when I actually render this video. Um, you can change them down here as well but it's just as easy to do up there. OK. So left click on the blue video strip and then come up to the button that says add left click on this and then next to effect strip left click on speed control now you don't have to adjust anything all you need to do is just left click on the, the end of the blue video track and then if you press G for grab just drag this so it marries up with the end of your, your um, track so if you remember we set this up at 408, this now says 408. Now if I play this back, it's in slow motion. Now this is where doing a slow motion video clip gets a little bit more complicated in Blender. The audio, although you can reduce the length of the audio no matter what you do with it you can't drag it out nothing happens you can make it shorter but you can't make it longer now there is a workaround for this it's very simple if you come up to the top of the screen and look for the render box then left click on this and then left click render audio I'll just you have to do this after you've set up the final length of your video clip. You can't do do it when you you know if I render this at 204, which is the original length, this won't work. So this is the one of the last things you should be doing. So anyway, as I said, back up to render, then render audio. Decide where you're going to save your audio, and also somewhere here yeah in the container it should, it should probably say some I don't know FLAC left click on this and I don't know I'm going to left click on MP3 um, give it a title I don't know DA that'll do and then left click a couple of times in the top um, right hand corner and you should quite quickly find that you've got a music file 
drag this into your timeline and it will marry up to the length of your clip. You can get rid of your original um, audio by just left clicking on it and then pressing X on your keyboard then left click erase strip. OK. Now I'm going to select the audio strip, the green one, by left clicking on it and what I'll do is I'll just unmute my video oh, audio a minute and hopefully you can hear what's happening. And as you can hear, the actual um, audio finished towards the end of the blue clip, the blue video clip. So let's just go back to the beginning. With this um, green clip selected, come over to the right hand side and look for something in the sound section called pitch. Now, as soon as we've slowed this down by 50% we've made this track twice as long so what you're going to do is you're going to half the pitch so if you left click in the box that says pitch 1 and type in point 0.5 and then play back your video hopefully you'll hear this And that's all there is to it. Nothing more clever than that. Um, I won't go into rendering or uh, the full video and that. Like I said at the beginning, hopefully you've got some knowledge of editing in Blender. Um, if anybody wants to work out how to put a sort of a section of a video clip so it goes from fast to slow, just leave a message under this video and I'll uh, bang another tutorial out showing you how to do that. Um, so that's all there is to it really. Thank you for watching. Cheers.